But um, <laughs> when I was younger, I was obsessed with one of the greatest musicals of all time. This show had a flawless fucking score, and it's absolutely in the history books of one of the greats. I'm obviously talking about Footloose. The <laughs> <laughs> I was so obsessed with this show when I was younger that I would spend hours in my room with the stereo blasting the entire CD from start to finish and act out the entire show in my room. This is, this is no joke. And anyone who, anyone who knows the show knows that there's no role in it for a 10 year old girl. So in my mind, I created the part of Ren, well he's the main guy, his younger sister, <laughs> Regina. Yes. And she had her own character development, and she had her own lines, and she had her own solos and everything. And it was to a point, and my parents here, they contested. If I ever like got in trouble and was like, Carolyn, go to your room, it was just yes! Because I would use this opportunity to put the show on for myself. And within minutes, the lights would be off, and my door was completely shut because I was in trouble. And then you look under the door, and you would just see like my little like lava lamps and disco balls, like all these colored lights coming from under my room. And within minutes, you'd be like, they didn't work in so hard, my mom's like, we can't, what are we gonna do? We can't even send her to her room because it's like a <laughs> So I can honestly say, standing on stage and acting or singing one of the songs from Footloose in front of a live audience versus my stuffed animals is actually like a dream come true for me. And I'm super excited that playing my run tonight is my good friend, fellow Boston Conservatory alum, Tony Ward, nominated actor. Knows rock music better than anyone else in the world. Please welcome Constantine Marulis. No, we can't see you. And so I guess it's packed. Huh? It's, it's awesome to be here. Um, I, I didn't grow up with Footloose the, the musical, but I did grow up with Footloose the movie, so it came a little bit before the musical. And, uh, but anyway, um, you know, uh, it's, it's awesome to be here with you guys. So uh, I, I, did, I did get a chance to go to a great school. and. and <laughs> and uh, the the, uh, the the nice bartender in the back earlier, she's like, boy, American Idol really paid off for you, didn't it? <laughs> earlier in the soundtrack, and I was like, yeah. <laughs> but um, beyond that, you know, I've, I've always had a passion for this and, and hard work and, and, uh, and dedication and uh, you know, be you know, right place at the right time. And I, I I can't wait to see all these performers on Broadway one day. So especially this one. Uh, to know her family a little bit over the years, kind of been like a big bro to her, so uh, let's have some fun. And uh, last night I was partying with Justin Bieber, um, I'm not even kidding, I had a shirt off and everything. <laughs> so there were some adult beverages and uh, I'll probably fuck this whole thing up. So. And my two year old is here too, my two year old is here. Alright, let's have some fun. I thought the dreams belonged to other men Cause each time I got close They'd fall apart again I feared my heart would be in secrecy I faced nights alone
And all these dreams I save for a rainy day See you.